Hello my friends and welcome back to another video and today we're playing some more Evil Dead the game and I just paused there at the very beginning so you see the level of these guys yeah these guys are well one of them is very high level is almost 500 and the other two are above level 100 and one is level 46 so I just want to show you my thought process on this match which was a really tough match they were together all the time okay we're near misery manor and then from the placement of the of the of the points i assume they are south as usual go trapping along my way i can see any is a level is a prestige five she's gonna be a hard cookie and you're gonna see why i have to say brilliant brilliant team they've made a few critical mistakes and i have a feeling if any scotty and henry are a team and maybe the other ash the support ash he is not but the three of them they know to stick together because he's now you know balanced bar and you're gonna see the weapons they're using henry and scotty they're using a shovel and a sledgehammer i mean you can't get more balanced bar meta than that right and, and any on top of it <laughs> so they did a really good job always want to max my traps because i want those elites in the field because once you have enough elites in the field, and there they are, once you have enough elites in the field, it's just gonna be thunderstruck everywhere. And they can't dodge too many of those. She's doing some funny noises. I'm not sure what she's doing. I have a feel. I almost thought, is she dodging? Is she cheating or something? I'm just gonna go straight for the possession. She's alone. Oh, actually, the other two are just coming out. Gosh, that balance and that balance bar goes down very quick. But you know, I'm gonna post. Um, I'm gonna post on the link below my tree I'm using, and I don't have any balance bar points on my on my basics. I have balance bar points on my elites, but not on the basics. People still don't think the elites of the puppeteer are good. I just don't understand. They are good. <laughs> <laughs> they're one of the best things about the puppeteer okay, they fell for a trap they're just playing cool they're trying to stick together maybe I'm not quite sure exactly why Scotty stops like that he keeps doing that throughout the match I'm not sure why I'm gonna keep them busy drop some units and I don't know where support Ash is at this point but I'm just gonna stop possessing them because that just means points for me right and they're just sort of hanging around the bridge, which is weird. I don't know if they're waiting for support Ash or what they're doing. But they went back to the bridge and then they're coming back again. I don't know if they're confused or what's going on. Right. It's Thunderstruck. This is a power possession. But Thunderstruck comes back very quickly. And that's a big lag that just happened there. I'm not sure what happened. Okay, they both dodged it. That was very good. Uh, balance bar is gone. And they both dodged it. Very good again. The thing is, at this point, they're dodging. It's only the two of them. I'm alone here. It's very easy for them to dodge. Of course it is. Uh, and now he fell for it. They'll make, mistake. They'll make mistakes. The same as we make mistakes as a demon. They make mistakes. So Annie had to waste one of her champs there, the support wasn't around. And after traps, I'll keep trying to max my elites and then basics. And then as soon as I have points on the boss, I am going to put points on the boss and I'm going to get that boss out because the boss can be a massive game changer, but you have to know when to use it and what was the right time to use it, right? Hopefully this will help you with your thought process. So. Map pieces here. I'm just gonna trap along the way because they're coming here. There you go. Go straight for it. I'm gonna power possess this. I'm gonna try and give my hard time. That flashlight is really good. You see when they have the flashlight on, I can barely see what they are, but I can kind of guess it. So I'm just gonna keep going for it. And support Nash, he has a similar pattern of playing as the others. He just walks backwards towards his teammates. He didn't try to engage me. He didn't turn his back on me so it's a similar mo 
under your nose. The living have completed the map. Do better. Right, all the traps being triggered. The health is crap. I'm sure they have the healables to heal themselves, but it just shows you want to trap as much as you can along the way, anywhere you think they might go to. I don't have any energy here to possess him. I will drop this. And I was wondering if they were going to terminal to, um, to the building at terminal station here or not. But I think they've already been there. And here I'm just a little bit late for the chest, but that's okay. Still managed to get a scare here on Henry. Just gives me a bit of energy. Gets his fear up again. Yeah, and Annie is on me. This Annie is a brilliant player. Very good player. I was gonna set up the trap and then I realized they're not coming this way. Why am I why am I wasting my energy here? Yeah, a lot of the time we panic, right? And we start thinking, oh, I'm just gonna trap around a little bit more, little bit more, because it might come. And then actually they're going the other way. So stop, look, breathe, <laughs> and then make a decision. Yeah, a few seconds like this is not gonna change massively. So they're going for that point, the dagger now. I can get the boss out. And it's probably a good idea to get the boss out before point because I can because then I can probably get it during point as well so I might as well just try and deplete them as much as possible I'm playing the long game here right right and this boss here I don't do a really good job she's standing on that hill you see because then it's harder for me to hit her so she knows what she's doing, and here my attacks are going all over the shop. I'm doing a terrible job. I'm trying to get the AoE attack back. And they're dodging towards me as well, which means I can't see where they've gone. They're doing a good job. I still get some hits. I mean, the boss is worth it just for that AoE attack, right? Okay, lasting quite a long time. There we go. So now he's on cooldown. And they haven't started point yet. So I can probably get the boss out soon again. Okay. So let's do the usual, right? We'll trap all around the perimeter. Don't leave any traps out. Just do it. And you can drop some units in the meantime. Because then there's more units on the floor, you keep them engaged, they're not just sitting around. Alright, I'm gonna possess this guy. If anything, it gives me the points. If you possess one of them, while there's loads of units around, that means they're down one person, right? They need to worry about the one that's possessed, plus all the other units around. Alright, here's a power possession, all four of them fell for it. Okay, I'm not sure we can get another one here. And we do. Nice. Okay. I'm just gonna trap a little bit around because they will come this way. Okay, I'm just looking for traps. Alright, let's go. I almost fell on my trap there. Now I got no balance fire. When you're using your basics, you want to try and dodge a bit. Now this I don't know if it was the play, but what I did here was I possessed him and because he was low on health, I knew he was going to die from possession damage. I didn't have any traps around, unfortunately. But I just walked him away a little bit, and I hoped this was gonna be enough, and it was. They were almost down with point anyway, so was this necessary? Maybe, maybe not, but oh, she doesn't have any bullets. And Harry's on my back. We got some hits on Sash. Let's get the traps on. Keep trapping, I think. 
Okay, Scotty didn't go down completely, but that's okay. Oh, my leads are maxed out now. We're level 20 now, and we only finished the first point. That's good. I'm gonna go straight back to them, because why not? I don't want to go to the other point and start trapping there. I don't know what they're gonna do. I don't want to let them find more shems and, you know, healables and bullets. I want to keep them... I'm gonna keep the pressure on. Do more traps. There's a chest up there, which I didn't trap, and that may be a mistake. I can get boss again. And this is exactly what I'm gonna do. Right, he's busy with the units, and I get the boss out. I just wanna harass them. Right, I got two units on the floor, and another one. I'm just gonna go for this stash a little bit because he's messing around. Go back. And this stone hurl attack it's really devastating right if you hit them on if you hit them twice with that it's almost 400 damage really it's massive right, Scott is gonna go down here because he's really low nobody's looking after him okay I wanna try and get him to die but this Stone attack gets blocked by Henry. So that, that was a good play. He, he body blocked me there. So very well done. The healing. We trapping. And they're just looting here. I missed that box up there. Like I said. A little missed opportunity there, but not total disaster. They're quite high again on heals. They probably found some bits. And there's a bug here with the boxes, you see the boxes don't show, it's really weird. Oh, here we go, power possession again on the lead, I just, I just, I just think this is the best. Alright, let's go. That was 450 damage. Nice. All the shields they had are gone now. See this glitch of the box? He shows up after. Weird. I'm on PS5. Okay, I am gonna use my Demon Dash because I don't think I'm downing anyone right now, so I might as well. And I got the boss again. Does he have a card there? They should be going for the card now, but they're kind of messing around, I think. Could be doing this a little bit better, but but they you know they're staying together. Look. Good, then Scott is going down again, I think. Yeah. I could have had my Demon Dash now, you see? But, would, have, would that have made a huge difference? Maybe not. I have a unit on the ground there, so... It's delaying them, I can't find any energy around me. I start looking. Okay, we got enough to possess a car if they take that car. And they take in the car. Okay, so I'm just gonna go ahead of them as soon as they drive past me, I'll possess. So this is how you wanna do with cars. Possess. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead, collect more energy. That's one orb, two orbs, three orbs, four orbs, and here they trick me. <laughs> but then they make a mistake, so I possess the car again. Yeah, I managed to maybe damage them a little bit there, doesn't matter too much. And I'm just gonna do the same. Collect the orbs along the way. And then they knock, they're not coming. Something's happening there with Henry, but then he jumps in the car and then off they go, but then I, I can possess the car again. And one of them must be pissed off at this point because he runs off, look at that. That's the mistake. The three stays together, the support goes on his own. So that makes me think, is he a one-man band? I'm not sure. But I can get the boss out again and on 1v1 against the support is a down. That's what I'm gonna do. Yeah, and the rock blocked me. He's going for a car. I'll damage him a little bit. And AoE is gonna be shocked a bit. 
There you go. Huge damage. And now he's toast. Okay. I did possess the boss because they're coming. I want to prepare myself now for them to come and pick up support dash. So here they come. Put more points in there. So you see, whenever they go alone, they will make this mistake. One of them always does. And then you just go for them. Yeah, whoever it is. Right. They're all here. Messing about. Nice hit there. We're gonna dodge that. Okay. He's got his ability on, so we're not doing anything there. Fine. Well, we can possess someone. That, oh, I actually wanted to possess one of the survivors, but that's okay. We're getting some good hits there. I still possess them. Just want to harass them, right? Harass them as much as you can. Again, not sure it's the best use for Demon Dash, but I just couldn't resist. <laughs> Alright, I got one of them there. <laughs> Delaying them as much as possible. Managed to kick one of them. Gosh, and I can get boss out again already. See? All this delay. And someone else went down. Henry did. I mean, when a Henry goes down in a team on a, on, a, on a group of four like that, probably not a good sign. Right. If I get a boss now, they're gonna jump into a car, right? That's not what we want. I need to recharge. Uh, they trashed that car because they hit me. That was a really silly mistake. Right, here we go. Going alone again. Who is it? Support Dash. <laughs> All the other ones are just trailing behind him. They probably think, oh, here he goes. Let's just go behind him. Because he's gonna mess up again so he's about to start points i got the boss i'm just gonna start the i'm just gonna get the boss before they start point because i'm gonna waste their time right i don't want to let them start points healed they could they could have been starting point i think maybe i would have been doing that if i was a survivor why not? You just want to get the clock ticking, right? Oh, he started points just before. Hey, Scotty. I think Scotty's going to go down again now. Yep. Alright, and now I got my dashes, but actually I messed up here again. I possess a, a unit, but never mind. He went down anyway. I should have probably dashed there and prevent him to get the revive. But I think that was a mistake on my part. I'm just gonna chop a little bit around. I know one of them is down, but I've got units on the floor taking care of it. So now we possess Scotty. Off the point, they're messing around. Two of them are off point now. Okay, and he's down. Now it's just Annie. Annie and Scotty. And Scotty already ran down. He's the weakest link out of the two. And she's doing the cutscene stuff. Now she's got some bullets. And I'm crapping my aim. But I still managed to shoot him once at least. Okay. Can get the boss out again. I mean, why not? Let's do it. My first target, Scotty, because it's low, of course. Okay, now it's just Annie. Can she one v one a boss? They've got four dodges now, the leaders, right? So they are a lot stronger than they used to be. Okay, she does a good job there. She's doing a very good job. Yep, 
it's just too tough to 1v1 puppeteer boss. Anyway guys, I hope you found this helpful. If, if you did, drop me a like and subscribe for more and I will see you all next time. Humanity's last hope, broken, beaten and bleeding.